All right, guys, welcome to a remote electrician. First video is non-working outlets. And it's not your typical um, video that you have watched on YouTube many, many times where people basically show you this outlet and say, hey, press this button and it will reset your outlets or it will reset your circuits. So in this video, I wanna talk a little bit more because after working for the past two, three years as a residential electrician, I have come across many, many instances where people just bought their house very recently and they don't know much about their um, home yet and especially electrical stuff, all right? So, but yes, we're gonna talk about these outlets and number one cause of uh, non-working outlet is pretty much this GFCI, if you have one of these in your kitchen, in your bathroom, or outside exterior um, plugs, or it's not working, but you have your um, breaker on in your electrical panel. So why it's not working. So a lot of people don't tell you that in order to reset this outlet, you this outlet has to be receiving power. If it doesn't have a power, you will never ever be able to reset it. So why there are times you have your breaker on and you're not able to reset this outlet. You have all of your breakers on and this you can visually see that it has two bottoms, test and reset. So when this reset bottom is out, you're not able to press it. If you press it, it doesn't click. It doesn't come back on. So in that case, um, many, many times I have gone to homes where um, these outlets are switched. What that means is that power is coming into this outlet through the switch. And until that switch is in an on position, uh, you're not gonna be able to reset it because it needs to receive power in order to reset. I'll tell you two if, if you uh, instances where I um, have come across this type of um, issue. One instance was basically in the kitchen, under the cabinet, garbage disposal, had GFCI outlet plugged in, and customer basically is, hey, I have this outlet, and for some reason, I'm not able to reset it. Uh, even though breakers are all on, I don't know what's going on. Can you come take a look? And I ask for pictures and I tell her that in order to reset this outlet, please put your um, switch into on position and then try to press this button. And of course, it does work. It does click. And she's happy that she doesn't have to pay me because I don't want to go um, uh, pretty much for these kind of simple solutions, simple uh, things to reset an outlet and charge someone $250 or $200 or $150, bucks, whatever, all right? So another instance, people basically bought a brand new home and uh, their exterior outlets are all GFCIs and they're all, pretty much all of their landscape lighting is plugged into this outlet and then uh, they don't know basically how to turn it on because they, they, they pretty much lived there for a couple months. Lights were coming on automatically themselves, turning off in the morning themselves. This outlet is switched and from this outlet, whatever the power is going to the outlets that has in between timer that pretty much enables uh, power basically to um, go through this device at certain times, right? And they just didn't know what switch was controlling that outside or they have they had no idea. So I had to spend at least an hour to figure out why that GFCI uh, is not working while everything else in the electrical panel is on. But when I even pull out this outlet, uh, it doesn't have a power. So and it was switched. So make sure in your home, if you're not able to reset this outlet, of course, many, many instances where I have gone to places where bathrooms have these regular outlets, 
but they don't know that inside they might have in their homes they might have five six bathrooms or three or four bathrooms and one of the bathrooms have this outlet GFCI outlet it, when this outlet trips it pretty much kills power for the rest of the bathrooms and they don't know what's going on and they call electrician for a simple solution like this so if you have non-working outlet problem I will be happy to help through the email that I'm gonna put in the description if it's something simple like this and of course I'm gonna put my contacts just because I'm just getting started with this YouTube channel I'll just put my uh, Venmo and stuff in case if you want to donate to support this channel so we'll be making more videos about non-working outlets and many many other subjects that I have come across while working as an electrician um, and yeah that's the video thanks for watching I hope it helps see you in the next one take care peace